Hi everyone, welcome to Zazu Exotics. Uh, today I went to hiking and I found some interesting insects. Uh, one of them is a praying mantis and the other one is a stink bug. Stink bug. Uh, it's an orange stink bug and surprisingly the praying mantis is not interested in it. Never attacked it. I bring it here to show you guys. Uh, this praying mantis since I was, I was child, I was collecting them, taking care of them, keeping them as a pet. Uh, but uh, there is one thing about them, they live uh, only around like uh, one year. Their lifespan is very short. So, because they uh, die after they laying eggs, uh, I give up on them. Yeah, I didn't continue keeping them as, as pet because when my animal die, it's very sad for me. Yeah. Uh, here we have a praying mantis. There are 2,400 type of praying mantis all around the world, and uh, you can see them everywhere. Uh, in German, uh, we call them Gottesanbeterin, uh, which is, is same like a uh, praying mantis. The translation is a direct translation from praying mantis. And look at the color. They are so amazing. They can, uh, um, they have this ability to camouflage. That means uh, they can hide uh, in the trees and impossible for human eyes to spot them or any other animal because they don't move much and they are waiting. They are opportunistic uh, predators. Whatever they can catch, they will eat. Uh, I've seen them. They are eating lizards, small frogs, whatever they can catch. They can they, they're gonna eat it and this one is a pretty small one I've seen a really big one uh, yeah they are really amazing after um, pairing with the male female starts eating the male yeah female starts eating the male alive yeah these guys are cannibals and look how amazing they are their eyes you see these antennas you see they are um, um, I don't know if you can see this one but with my fingers movement he or she is reacting you know now he changed the direction but uh, yeah people are scared of them because yeah I agree <laughs> uh, they are they look a little bit creepy but yeah if you know them they are really cool animals, really cool insects. Uh, uh, yeah, the more you learn about them, the more you fall in love with them. Look how they are, uh, how they are moving. You see the movement to the back and forth, back and forth. This is uh, resembling the leaves on the trees, which makes them invisible. When they are on uh, on the trees, you you really cannot see them. It's not easy to see them. So. Uh, I'm gonna feed this one with a mealworm. Unfortunately, I don't have uh, other insects as a feeder now at home. I'm gonna feed it with the mealworm and see is it going to catch it or not. Either way, he's eating it or not. Tomorrow, I'm gonna release it back in the mountain. Here you go. Maybe it's not hungry. Because they never say no to food if they are hungry. Uh, you see, he catch my tongue. Come here. The food is here. Food is there. You gonna eat or what? They are truly amazing animals. I really love them. Oh, the male one found them. Uh, yeah, looks like it's not just, uh, hungry. So, yeah, I'm gonna keep it in a box. Uh, so tomorrow I go again hiking. I'm gonna release it. It's really beautiful. Look at you. Oh, some of them they can fly. Some of them they can't. But 
really. They have a triangular shaped head, very strong jaws, very strong forearms. You see these arms, um, they catch the prey with these arms. And once they catch the prey, and <laughs> no way for the prey to uh, run away or can get away with these guys. They start straight away, they start eating alive, no matter what. Yeah, okay. Another <laughs> insect, I, I catch also a longhorn. <laughs> I take it out of the box, he ran away, <laughs> very smart. I mean, um, yeah, fly away. And this one is a orange stink bug. Uh, there was another one, another stink bug. I always see them together. Uh, I'm no expert in this insect, but I always see this uh, two stink bug together one of them is under the branch one of them is on top the other one the color is like a brown to olive brown I will take it uh, I, I already take a picture of that one I will show you and yeah I, they always together I don't know what is the relationship between I always between these two guys always I see them in nature this guy is under the branch, under the leaves, hiding. The other one is on top. And that one also have uh, hands, the forehands are, uh, look like a praying mantis, like here, this one. But smaller and uh, bigger. No, I mean like thicker, not bigger than praying mantis. Yeah, this is a stink bug. I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna touch it because they stink really bad. I don't wanna stink like bikes. Look at this guy. In Greek, oh, I jumped on the camera. You see how how fast they jump. This is how they surprise their prey. They jump on the prey. They can jump really fast. And uh, you see the for the the legs. Their legs is very powerful. They pump the blood inside the legs and they jump. And you see, it's gonna jump on the uh, camera. <laughs> Come here. Yeah. Mmm. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah, I was saying, uh, in Greek, they believe the. In Greek mythology, they believe that the praying mantis have uh, supernatural powers. I don't know how they think about that or how this idea come to their mind but yeah uh, they are very popular in pet trade we have a praying mantis here that's an orchid praying mantis which is very beautiful uh, one of my friends have one I'm gonna make a video of that they look amazing they look like orchid flower
yeah I find the old video of feeding praying mantis which is, which was the same species but different animal and I added to this video so you can see how they catch and eat yeah uh, that's it for today's video I hope you enjoyed it and see you guys